Hi my loves and welcome back to my channel. My name's Rosie for those of the, you that have just found me. Um, I generally upload videos two or three times a week, usually lifestyle hauls. Today's video is a B&M haul, um, just because I need a, a few bits and pieces for the month and I'm also going to be doing some decorating. So yeah, if you like the video, I know it's a little bit premature, but please don't forget to give it a thumbs up as it just helps my channel get out there. I am a relatively new channel and it just helps my platform. Um, also, if you haven't already, I would love for you to subscribe. So please, please, please hit the subscribe button. Um, yeah, so as I said, B&M, I have literally spent £160. It's a lot, but honestly, as I said, I am decorating, so yeah, I needed to pick up like toiletries for the month, and then obviously like some paint and bits and pieces. Um, so I'm just gonna show, like, get into it, and obviously show you what I've got. Excuse, I've just got, I've got my cup of tea. I've got a sore throat. I think I'm coming down with something. Um, I'm always moaning. <laughs> ignore me honestly but no I have, I've got a bit of a sore throat and stuff so I think I'm getting a little bit pooly um how is everybody how's your day been so far it is what day is it today I'm gonna say it's Friday today so happy Friday guys um weather's a bit miserable but it's not too bad so I'm literally as I said it's bits and pieces for the month and stuff and a couple of new products in there that I spotted that I, you know I thought I'd try and stuff um so first things first this is the she says this is the daz all-in-one pods and this is the cherry blossom um and it's the book pink edition and it was 8.99 and i mean it's 43 washes so yeah and i know usually i buy lenore and i've been buying the mrs hinch lately but i do like to swap it up every now and then because i don't know about you guys but i think you start to get a bit nose blind you know like if you start to like if you keep using the same sense over and over again I, I do think you become a bit nose blind so i picked up the dars now i have had them before i think it was a couple of i think around about christmas time when i picked them up and they are really nice and i do like them so then some dishwasher tablets because once again I find myself running out of dishwasher tablets. Now these were the ones that I found in B&M. These are the Fabulosa ones and they're lemon. There's 54 tablets. They are suitable for vegans. So if anybody's looking for dishwasher tablets that are vegan, Fabulosa. Um, and it's the all-in-one and it's a dishwasher tablet. It, it's just going to do what every other dishwasher tablet does but it's not as obviously they haven't gone all out and yeah it's just gonna be as good so when i mean like when i say they haven't gone all out i'm not slating the brand i mean just as like you know like some of them like look really really fancy and because of that they they're like nine ten pounds and i have fallen into that bracket where i would i will pick them up because of the gel tablets and stuff but i've found that the cheaper tablets are just as good as yeah the the, the, the more expensive brands um, so again, Fabulosa, four ninety nine. That's gonna last round about the month, maybe even a little bit longer. Um, some bleach. Again, this isn't the branded one. Fifty five pence, and this is the easy, seriously thick citrus. I think this is just like B and M's own, and I think it's just like it, it, it's generally what you would get. Like I'll just let you see, like Aldi and stuff. Um, around about the same price tag i would say lenore fabric conditioner again i've kind of moved away from the mrs hinch this month just because as i said i think you start to go nose blind and i just like to i like to be able to smell like my washing and stuff um and i just find if i use the same fabric conditioner over and over again i kind of i can't smell it anymore so this is the lenore adorable tropical sunset and this is the ultra concentrated and you get 76 washes out of it now this was reduced it to I think it should have been four pounds ninety nine, but this was like three ninety nine. <clears throat> I know the price is correct, and I know it was reduced. I do apologise if it wasn't four ninety nine though, but I know I did save some money. <laughs> um, I'm just not feeling too good today, so I'm a little bit yeah. I'm I'm not like paying too much. 
um, but I have put all the prices on for you guys so I am obviously getting better in that sense um, then some Dr Beckman carpet cleaner this is the carpet stain remover this stuff's really good um, I swear by it it's £2.75 a bottle and I just picked up the one and it's because I'm decorating Lexi's bedroom who is my little girl and um, there's a few marks and stuff on the carpet so it was either get a new carpet or just you know get the um cheaper option which is the carpet cleaner because i can guarantee you if i even if i put a new carpet down there'll be marks all, uh, again on the carpet so yeah for two pounds 75 it's a cheaper a bit cheaper than actually going out and buying a new carpet my plan is is literally just i've bought her a new rug so um obviously i'll scrub the carpet up get it clean and then the um the new rug will go down and everything um yeah total bedroom transformation it needs it trust me some new bubble bath i just thought you know what this looks really it smells really nice as well to be fair it was only a pound um and it's refreshing golden glow um it smells well like it's got peaches on the front so it's gonna it smells peachy um and again for anybody that's vegan it's the astonish um brand which is actually from what i can gather and what i've been it's nice from what i've been told um yeah, it's a it's a good brand um especially for like if you're looking for vegan products and stuff shampoo this is the l'oreal l beef i usually buy this one um i normally stick to this brand and in fairness this is the restoring shampoo um and this was on special offer this again was reduced to four pound 49 i know it was just over five pound i think um and it's the bigger bottle so it's going to last hopefully a little bit longer than a week um which is like what the smaller bottles do because there are eight of us at home um so yeah and i normally pick up the conditioner to go with this as well but it's a bit strange because the conditioner for this is a restoring conditioner i'll explain all in a minute when i find the conditioner bottle um move it away from cleaning gherkins because my kids eat these like they're going out of fashion and i like to put them on burgers and stuff and every time i buy them they sneak them and yeah before you realize you know the mom can have a pickle and then they're gone so i just like to make sure that i'm stocked up on them anyways one pound 59 for it's actually a really big jar um so yeah i thought i'd pick that up just digging around in the bags i've got like two big well i got two bags and then I just ran out of space, so yeah, I only picked up, obviously, um, I only had two bags with us. Um, then I've just picked up some heat protection spray. This is $3.99 and it's got to be Guardian Angel. Um, I've not tried this before, so hopefully it'll be fine. And it's literally for, to, for blow dry and heated styling tools. So, yeah. Right, so the detangling conditioner, that's the LB one, but I don't, it's kind of like, see what I mean? They're both like the same colour and I always buy this one and then I pick the shampoo up as well because I can never find the detangling shampoo. So I'm just wondering if it's because they're the same colour. I don't, I mean, it, it says long damaged hair, so it must obviously, I'll assume that it's like, that is the conditioner that goes with that shampoo. So this is the detangling conditioner and I find this really really good for like my little girl's hair and stuff um, and that's Lexi because yeah she's got long like long hair um, and she doesn't always look after it and when she gets up on the morning she's always got bed head so the, shamp the, the conditioner helps really really well um, and it just saves like spending a ton of money on all the detangling like sprays and everything which I've tried in the past and they're not always that good. Um, this was 3 99 and it's again a big bottle. It's 25% more. And I know this was on offer as well. It should have been slightly more expensive. Um, but yeah, and then also Marley, who's got like really wavy hair, like really curly, it's like ringlets and stuff. Um, when she looks after it as well. What is it with girls and the fact that they just they don't look after their hair? Um, I'm constantly, constantly honoured them. But anyways, um, when she does like look after it, it's absolutely beautiful. And yeah, so this helps massively. Um, Sanex. 
This is just the body wash and it's the, I want to say Biome Protect Micello um, body wash. And it's got vitamin B5 in it, it's revitalising and it's the shower gel and it's £1.49 a bottle. And then for my hair, because I have scalp psoriasis, um, I tend to use medicated shampoo, um, which absolutely stinks and I hate it. Um, I use like Nizorol. I don't know if any of you guys have, I have to use that as well, but yeah, it's absolutely horrible. Um, I feel your pain if you do, honestly. I got this when I fell pregnant with my oldest son, who is... Obviously, he doesn't live at home, but yet, yeah, up until that point, I never actually had anything wrong with my skin. Um, I had really good skin. And when I fell pregnant with Jamie, I got scalp psoriasis and obviously, like, body psoriasis. <laughs> so, certain things bring it out, um, but my scalp is, yeah, it, it, it's really bad. Um, I go through periods where I have really bad breakouts and stuff. And I just wanted to try, because I, I miss ordinary shampoo. And the LV one, I can kind of get away with it. I can maybe use it once or twice, and then I have to go back to my medicated shampoo, which is Polytar and Nizorol. Um, so I picked up the Aveeno because I find I use the Aveeno moisturizer for my skin, and especially like on here where I get really dry, the Aveeno is I find it it's it's amazing. Um, and for the fact that you know like it's it's you can buy it over the counter and stuff like that, you don't have to get it prescribed it's really really good and it's really affordable so I, I spotted like i've seen these before and they're just like the shampoos and the conditioners and this one's for dry and damaged hair and it's made with colloidal oat so i thought why not it's like scalp soothing hair care if it's as good as the cream like the moisturizer then hey yeah i'm, I'm gonna give it a shot this was three pound 89 um and i know they do have other types Oh, and it smells. I mean, it smells amazing. That's something else that kind of bothers me. You know, like if they're highly perfumed, I just kind of think, oh God, straight away I'm like, is that is that gonna annoy my scalp? Is it gonna irritate? But we won't. I'll I'll, I'll give it a shot. Harpic toilet freshener, one pound nineteen. This is the Berry Burst. Really good. You just like check it. <laughs> Some command. Um, little hooks, the see-through ones, and these are for Lexi's bedroom when I decorate it. These were three pound seventy-nine. I've not actually used those command strips before, so um, yeah, hopefully they'll 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 be all right. What do you guys think about them? Because um, normally I just use like the the, the old hooks. Some flash. Um, strong thick anti back wipes now these are like double sized so you can actually like the, the do I think the, I think the tear down the middle so you can get two out of one and you get 24 large or 48 small in the pack um, and these are the cherry blossom ones and they are anti back um, they're recycled fiber um, obviously I don't generally tend to buy wipes but to be fair, it, it's like usually for the toilet and stuff. And I have a dog who has um, indigestion problems, well, digestion problems that he tends to, because of his breed. Um, I think the vet says he tends to throw up a lot after he's eaten and stuff. Um, so yeah, we are trying charcoal at the moment and a couple of other things. Um, but it doesn't always work, unfortunately, and he's quite an old dog, bless him. So yeah, it's just water, and if he he, he, he tends to like, <clears throat> he just what's the words I'm looking for? He literally just like inhales his food and his water, like he doesn't chew, and then the next thing you know, it's it's literally like blah, and it's coming back up. Anyways enough of that I will get off it so anyways I bought these wipes and I actually bought two packets of these and they were a pound each and it worked out to just get these cheaper than it would be to buy um the other brands like the bigger packs so yeah two of those and speaking of the pooch I picked him up some bacon sizzlers well the meaty yeah bacon scissors lower silk scissors bacon scissors guys 
bacon sizzlers, low in fat, no artificial um, colours and flavourings and no preservatives and they're not raw hide and yeah they were only a pound so I just thought I'd pick them up for him he likes a wee, he likes a wee treat flosses, 14 a pack, a pound wisdom antibacterial mouthwash um, and I bought this one basically because I when I eat crisps and stuff like that it tends to have a tooth and it tends to kind of like um, irritate it and it's been irritated a little bit um, so I thought I'd pick up some antibacterial mouthwash um, and it tends to work really really well and it's wisdom and it was £1.89 um, and it's fresh mint and yeah what else can I say it's mouthwash <laughs> and then the shampoo to go with the Avino oat milk blend um as I said this was the same price as the conditioner which was 3.89 and yeah so I'm gonna give these a go and hopefully hopefully I'll be able to use them a little bit more often than what I can use um the other shampoos and stuff and I won't have to maybe use my medicated so so much Lexi's bedroom just some wall pieces I'm just trying to pick up like little bits and pieces you know for like just to brighten our walls up a little bit for when I decorate it this was three pounds um I know Amazon do sell um other colors and stuff so I think but I think they're a bit more expensive um so I'm gonna have a look at that they're not bad for three pounds I have got some other bits and pieces but I'm kind of like you know you just find like picking bits up as you go along um, and then I'm going to start the bedroom at the weekend so it'll give me plenty to do noodles these are the cocoa ones um, kids love these and I picked up two and I want to say that they were £1.49 yeah £1.49 each curry flavour just easy as a snack I must be like and then obviously again with the noodles um these are the lost pot noodle ones champion chicken i actually picked these up for Jaden um for his lunch but he did up having um something completely different and these were only 59 pence in fairness these worked out cheaper to buy than the pot noodles themselves kitchen roll one pound 19 kitchen roll do you know if the day goes that I can actually do a video without getting it wrong or mashing my words up or just forgetting my words you know um yeah give me a medal guys <laughs> I will throw a party anyways £1.19 it's strong kitchen foil and it's 10 meters and I need that for like my cooker and stuff and obviously I cook with it and everything so as well strawberry toilet freshener well, i suppose i don't think it's just for a toilet is it i mean you could put it anywhere it's limited edition it lasts 50 days these are really good these and b and m usually does two for about three pound fifty i want to say but this wasn't in the offer and it was two pound 49 but i picked it up anyway sorry guys can you yeah just yeah so hopefully i just thought it'd be a nice change and i like strawberry um then some colgate this is new but I've used it before. <laughs> it's the purple reveal, and this is two pound forty nine. I usually, if I can find it on offer, I normally get the one that's on offer. But that wasn't on offer, um, unfortunately. So I just picked that one up, anyways. Sticking with the strawberry theme, just some smelly, um, fresh air freshener. This one is the Strawberry Swirl Scent and it's limited edition again. It was £2 and it's just basically sitting in the loo upstairs. Um, keep the loo smelling fresh. Oh, one of the bottom bits have fell off it. Well, that wasn't clever, was it? I think it just slots back in. Sorry, guys. Just, yeah, it does. Just one of the little ribs fell off it. A slow down eating or, yeah, a slow feeder um because as i was saying about my dog buddy he tends to inhale his food and stuff now he is a french bulldog slash pig we're not quite sure <laughs> um, just the, the noises that he makes um i don't think he knows himself blessed but yeah 
So I thought I would give it a shot. Um, hopefully he'll be able to eat out of it. If not, then it's back to the drawing board. Um, if any of you guys have got any ideas, please feel free. Um, I would love some um, suggestions. Um, and this was three pounds. Like, sorry guys, this was actually, this, this was three pounds. Now in fairness, these go for like, I'm gonna say a pet at home, they're about 12 pounds, um, B&M three pound and have them in pink as well so not just that colour um and then a little toy for him just a little cute elephant because he likes his he likes his toys if you give him a ball and stuff he'll sit and pull it apart and it gets stuck it looks like he's got like a lock jaw because obviously because he's a, a french bulldog he's got like the really flat face um yeah so he, he just like has sometimes he has difficulty with like bones and things i mean i, I, I bought him like a huge bone um about it was just shortly after we um got him like after we rehauled him because buddy's like i want to say it's either five or six we're not quite sure obviously you know um he came to us out of um you know really sad circumstances but yeah um i won't go into that right now um but obviously you know we we took him because you know it meant that we got to keep um memories and stuff and obviously we, we just kind of like it feels like obviously um for the reason we took him that yeah just memories and things and um yeah <laughs> sorry i'm just rambling now anyways yeah so a squeaky little um elephant three pound fifty so you'll get fair chuffed with that he's got a pizza and a hot dog and he's got other bits and pieces but because of the way his mouth is and stuff like that it's just really hard to find stuff for him um antifreeze i picked this up for my daughter to be fair um because she's got really really like wavy uh, curly hair um frizz no more it's Crichton's and it's curl cream and it's got coconut and camellia oil in it um, and it is for curly hair and it was pound so yeah and it's mine she goes through stuff like it's going out of fashion um cookers cooker cleaning oh my god guys if anybody's obviously seen my um clean my cooker with my video um i didn't pick up i usually buy this mr muscle yeah and it's actually really good um and it does what i need it to do and i didn't pick it up and i used something completely different um i think it's the elbow grease or something and in fairness as good as it was it wasn't as good it, it didn't do what i needed it to do um i mean it may work for other people but obviously yeah it just didn't work for me so i give in and today i grabbed some mr muscle and because i know this will do the job um this was 2.99 and obviously it's oven cleaner and yeah um it won't take me three hours to well actually it took me all day to <laughs> clean an oven or clean the cooker like a full cooker never mind it looks sparkling now it's had like a whole revamp um so yeah that's the first bag i'm just gonna <laughs> chuck that across the living room you can tell i love my house guys can't you i mean i actually do love my house but yeah and then again just some i said i bought two packets so just some more white and that would be the second bag empty then we get to just a few more bits and pieces which were these are the shin noodle cups and these are the big ones does anybody else like these has anybody else tasted these i know you can get um you can get the black ones can't you which are like even more spicy um but yeah my kids swear by these and to be fair i've had them as well and i think they're really nice as well because i do like um spicy food one pound fifteen I know Asda sell them um, as well. I'm not sure where else sells them. Um, like our local like Chinese markets and stuff tend to sell them. Um, but in fairness, like they're the other side of town from me. So I, I, yeah, because I was in b and I, I just picked them up. Um, oh, smelly. Sticking with the smellies, this was 2 99 and it's just the strawberry swirl scent. Watch this be, hope it's not sickly. Um, yeah, because I don't know about you guys, but I find that some scents, actually some scents, 
some smells limited yeah like actually give me a headache um hopefully this isn't one of them so as i said 2.99 i'm gonna try that today i'm just gonna put it in my hallway um lexi's bedroom this is i learned to tell the time clock now it doesn't come with a battery but i've got batteries and i just think sometimes these are a little bit better um now i know she can tell the time on i think it's the digital clocks and stuff but the old-fashioned clocks like this and this is actually really good because you've got your quarter two your quarter past your half past your o'clock and it tells you the hours the minutes and everything and it was five pounds so that's gonna look really really pretty on our wall i said i'm having to do a whole whole revamp whole completely bedroom transformation um from start to finish it's just an absolute mess let's just say my 13 year old she has destroyed it um and which is really sad really because then obviously lexi my 10 year old it's just yeah it's, it's sad for her um so we've kind of like moved bedrooms around she's no longer sharing a bedroom with her older sister um who's going through her rebellious teenage years um is anybody else having that issue <laughs> like seriously it'd be nice to know i'm not the only one guys um and yeah so it's a throw just a um a snuggly throw it's another throw um really soft really pretty this one's the blue one i got this for xander um and it, it says seven pounds but in fairness it was actually reduced to four um the issue being is is when i've checked on the receipt I'm not actually sure that I got them reduced. So why does this keep happening to me? Like I, I see things that are different prices, and but it definitely said reduced, and it definitely said four pounds. That's why I picked them up because there was some more expensive. Well, there was some more that were like five pounds, and I just thought, well, I'm still saving up a couple, you know, because usually summer's coming in, so I wouldn't get this kind of like this fleecy throw. Um, I would have just picked the normal throws up, but because it was reduced to four pound, hey, why not? So this is the pink checkered one and it's just to pop on the ends of the beds if they you know if they don't want to use a duvet and they're a bit warm and they just want to throw um and again as i said it should have been four pounds but on the receipt i can't see anywhere where it says it was reduced so only me guys only me um oh. For my toilet downstairs because i am also decorating my toilet my goals for this month are my toilet downstairs and the bedroom lexi's well the girls the kids girls bedroom and um, lexi's bedroom that's this month's to do's um i am literally just you, you, do you know how hard it was <laughs> literally going around the shops because i've also been to b and q today as well to pick a few pieces up but yeah um that's a different like haul altogether and i don't know if any of you guys would be interested in seeing that so i'm not going to put it up on my channel at the moment um but yeah like literally seeing loads of stuff and they had b q had a 20 percent off garden furniture and everything today and i'm literally I'm, I'm biting my lip because i am desperate to just put things for like all the different rooms and all the pretty things that i've seen and i had to like bite my lip and walk away because yeah i just need to behave myself and do one room at a time um because i've had this conversation before with you guys and i am the typical person that literally yeah i try to do i start one project and then i think right okay now i'm gonna move on to another project and i just end up my house is upside down rooms aren't finished um my garden's a mess now as well and i just need to stop doing that and i need to concentrate on one thing at a time or even just two things at a time which will be a lot easier um so that's what i'm doing guys and i'm also rambling so i'm going to shut up anyway so this was 10 pounds um and it's really pretty and it's just a little pampas glass bars um and then this is like a little kind of like a, a mist bottle this was four pounds um and again just for the toilet downstairs 
I'm just trying to like pick little bits and pieces up and I'm trying to be I'm very I can be very picky when it comes to stuff as well so I'm trying not to be as fussy and um, but then again I want nice things and I don't want to be you know buy it and then think oh right I don't like that anymore so when I'm picking things I want to be I want it to look so I'm going to keep it basically so I want to be happy with it first time around if that makes sense um and then getting to the paint this is for my little girl's room this is for Lexi um she her favorite color is green so this is natural sage and this is the washable Matt Johnson's and it was 20 pounds um and it's actually a lot cheaper than the I want to say it, the Dulux I was going to say something else then <laughs> like seriously um honestly anyways never mind um yeah this is like a lot cheaper than that and I usually buy the Dulux paint the washable one and to be fair um I've been told the Johnston's is um just as good so yeah pick that up um washing machine cleaner 199 this is Dr Beckman's and it's new and improved apparently so I will give that a shot again that was the cheaper um one that I found and then just some storage boxes now I picked these up because I need to start looking at storage in my kitchen because I don't know about anybody else but I open my cupboards and everything just falls out or I can't find anything so I need to start looking at storage and these were meant to be like they're just the little fabulosa boxes and they're just to go under the sink you know to put like all my cleaning products in and stuff so I actually have some sort of form to one of my cupboards um, and they should have been £3 each but they're £1.50 each so I picked up the last three that were on the shelf and yeah so a bit of saving there and then last but not least some antique um chalk paint and this again is in the um antique sage color and it looks like a really nice green now the reason this is johnston's again and it was 12 pounds and the reason i bought this for is because my daughter's got some wooden drawers um i'm not sure what type of wood they are but they've lasted us i mean literally we bought them i'm gonna say six year ago six year ago and they've lasted for six year and they're still going strong so i don't want to chuck them out because they're real wood and i just thought like what can i do that's obviously yeah so anyways long story i'm gonna upcycle them and so i'm gonna i've got some primer already i'm just gonna change the handles on them which i'm gonna pick up i'm gonna have a look for um and see what i can find and then i'm gonna paint them this nice green so yeah i just thought you know like instead of chucking them out why not just upcycle them and it'll give me a project to do and it'll save us quite a bit of money than having to buy brand new drawers for her um because they are still in really 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 good condition apart from the fact that obviously because the six-year-old you know they've got a like, pen on them and stuff like that so at least if i sand them down and then you know if i upcycle them I'm saving a ton and a half of money and I'm also helping the environment so yeah and it gives me something to do so that is it guys that is my haul for today um as I said 160 pound I nearly had a heart attack when I got to the tail um but it's all the bits I need and in fairness it's all cleaning stuff that will last for the full month I won't need to do another hopefully um, unless I've forgot anything and, and looking at this I actually have forgotten a couple of bits um, but not to worry it's yet yeah, nothing that can't be picked up in a supermarket um, so yeah that's it guys so as I said you know how is everybody what's your plans for the rest of the day um, I'm just gonna finish my cup of tea I think I'm gonna I'm starting to get a little bit irritated on there sorry I keep like itching at it I'm trying not to make it worse um, I'm going to pop, pop a little bit of cream. I've got some of Vino upstairs, so I'm going to pop a little bit of cream on my face. Um, and then I am going to put all this lot away and look at what I'm making for the kids' tea tonight. Because um, they'll be due home from school shortly. I know they were doing, um, I think it's like the celebrations, like the for King Charles for the coronation weekend. They were having a day 
celebrations at school and stuff so they were doing activities and things so they'll probably have lots to tell me um so that'll have been fun for them bless and i know they'll be due in shortly so i am going to end the video here so i'm just going to say stay safe guys take care and i hope you have a lovely day for what's left of it um this video should be uploaded later on this evening if it's not it'll be up tomorrow morning which is saturday um again if you got this far and you've watched all of it well done i do like a good natter um and i do like a good catch up with you guys and yeah so please don't forget to give it a thumbs up because i am a new channel and it just helps my platform as i said at the start of the video and if you haven't already please 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 subscribe again as i said it just helps my platform and i would love you to join my youtube family and i would love to have a chat with you and get to know yours and if you fancy a chat pop your thoughts in the comments and yeah again take care lots of love and i'll see you in the next video bye